Hey there, Star Wars fans. This is JAR369. Welcome back for another brand new video review. Today, I'll be taking a look at the Star Wars Force Lean 2.0 2.0 starter pack by Hasbro. Now, take a look at the packaging here. You see the packaging with the kit holding with the Force Lean, and also it says includes Han Solo figure. Hmm. It's really lazy that you just added like this picture instead of the window of the figure. On the top you get the force link and figure whatever Star Wars logo. You get the solo cast. You get Lando, Han, Chewie, and of course uh Aurora. Aurora. Uh, and also on the side you can see two kids are playing the um force link. And on the back here you can see how this uh, force link works, but it also interacts with the other force link, which is kind of strange. I don't know why you need to get a second one. And also it shows other figures from this line. Well, not figures, but it just shows like others how this works. And you get figures, play sets and fecal sets from this line, like the Millennium Falcon. You get Han Solo with the vehicle, Infant's Nest with the vehicle, and Luke with the Wampa. And also the two pack figures, including some padded carded figures. So that's about it for the, the packaging. Now let's release the starter pack out of the package. Here we got the starter pack out of the package. Now let's start off with the figure first. Let's start off with Han Solo. Now the head scope on the figure, come on, focus. There we go. The head likeness to the actor who plays Han Solo, I think they did a great job on the head scope on him. It looks exactly like the actor who played him. Now take a look at the outfit here. You can see nothing much. Here. You can see the little silver thing on his uh, pockets on the trench coat there. You can see one pocket there on each of these pocket on the coat you can see the like the um the jacket is made out of the soft material rubber on the back nothing much else you get like the criss wrinkles on the um the sleeves on the jacket you get the little pocket there on his so soldier uh take a look at the belt there you can see the little silver piece there and you get the holster for his blaster uh, the pants, you can pretty much you see like the um, red stripes on the pants, you know, his usual pants. You get the wrinkles on the, um, the pants. The boots, nothing much on the boots, just plain old black boots. And on the bottom, there's some there's some legal crap and also a force link. And a peggles for on the bottom of the feet. Overall, overall the figure itself it looks really well done. Now, for articulation, it's pretty much exactly the same as the 5PO8. You know, you get the head rotation, you get the ball joint, arms. But this time, it has wrist articulation. I mean, that's really, that's really interesting. How come there's wrist articulation? Uh, no waist articulation, sadly. Legs go forward and back, and that's about it. Now, for accessory, he does came with a splaster here. Just a plain black blaster. You, it fits nicely on his hands, but it also fits on the holster. Come on, there we go. It fits nicely on the holster. Well, but I'm gonna display him with the blaster on him. Now let's look at the force link here. Stay, stay. There we go. Stay. There we go. Uh, now take a look at the force link. You know, it's just pretty much exactly the same as the um the the last Jedi force link, but just like in different colors. You get like instead of black is white, and with a blue smudge there. To instead of the uh, blue on the prints, you you got green instead. On the back, nothing much else except there's no, except there's a legal crap and no. On and off switch, which is I really wanted it to be like an on and off switch, so you don't have to like turn it on because it might waste the battery or your battery died on this. 
It'd be a good idea if Hasbro just added like the on and off switch and maybe look. Yeah, I mean it took too long to turn this thing off, but it's not like. I mean, I really wish it had like the on and off switch. Maybe like the on and off switch right here. Like you just turn it off. That's about it. And so you have to save battery. I mean, since it's for a kid, I mean, it kind of fits in my hand very easily. Hold on, let me just do this off camera. It kind of fits in my hand, but like it's not really matched to the the figure. I mean, the force link. Let me just turn this on. So hear what what Han Solo has said. Oh no. Oh, let's see the fire blasters. Blast him! Okay, stay sharp. Woohoo! This better be worth it. Alright, so he says six phrases. Now let's... I, the only Force Link figure I have is Supreme Leader Snoke, so let's bring him out. Okay, so he says about like five phrases. Oh. Actually, make that. Actually, actually, make that six because of the when you put the force link on. And for Han, he says about seven phrases as well. But overall, I say the force link is not that bad at all. I mean, I really wish. Hasbro can make like like I don't know like stop making those force links instead and just give us the figure instead because we don't want to get another one we already have the one from the last Jedi set but again but I know Hasbro wants money so hey why not just give him the force link the Han Solo figure looks really well done I think it looks really good now now I really wish this force link here has like the on and off switch like I said I just like I don't want to waste battery on it because it takes too long to turn off so my rate on this figure I'm going to give this starter for the force link I'm going to give it like a 4 they call me Han Solo I don't run from a fight um, for this like I said for this starter this uh, force link I'm going to give it like uh, a 4 out of 10 and also for this um, Han Solo figure, I'm gonna give him my, about a a um, a five out of ten. So that's about it. Make sure to tune in for new videos daily. Don't forget to turn on the bell icon to be notified new videos after you subscribe. And also follow me on Instagram and Twitter. Both the links will be in the description down below. So that's about it. This is J A R three six nine and goodbye.